Hello everybody, this is Havoc, and welcome back to Ultimate General Civil War. We had a, uh, it was an okay battle last time, but we're gonna try and, uh, definitely do a much better battle of this time over here at South Mountain. Now, as you can tell, I've really upgraded my army, been able to really smooth out a lot of kinks, and hopefully be able to create a really nice, good elite army. We're looking at a solid, almost 70,000 men here. I mean, probably right at about 70,000 just to be able to lead up to this battle if we were to uh in the future if we if we win this we get you know i have an extra fourteen thousand men plus a hundred and forty thousand dollars plus whatever i can get from my reputation which won't be the five thousand or the hundred and twenty five thousand unfortunately but i could at least get maybe some napoleons or something we could be looking at about seventy five thousand men for the battle of anti-atom on our side alone. So you're probably, I mean, we could probably get close to 150, 175,000 men in the Battle of Antiatom. Now I know, I just like Antiatom. It just seems like that's a cool name. I like it. So we're going to stick with Antiatom. <clears throat> uh, potato, potato. Regardless, let's go ahead and dive into South Mountain. It is the 14th of September, 1862. Lee is entered into Maryland and northern soil for the first time. He dispatched Longstreet with the right ring of the Rebel Army at Boonesboro. You need to drive part of your army through Fox's and Turner's gaps and attack Longstreet. The rest of your army will move to break the siege of Harper's Ferry and relief its garrison that is attacked by Jackson's left wing of the Rebel Army. We get 135 grand and 8,100 soldiers. All right, let's go ahead and deploy the first legion there. All right, uh, you need to drive. I think that we've all said that there. So it looks like they have three main parts that they are defending, three main lines of defense. If we have this whole map, I definitely see us being able to take these woods here, these woods here, maybe being able to flank around there, maybe get some flanking going on to here too, see if we can't swing around and hopefully uh, get outside of them. All right, so uh, let's go ahead and let's take a look. Uh, they have about 30,000 men. They have double over double the guns that we have, uh, but we have 2,000 more men than they do. Thanks to our new reconnaissance that we've upgraded, we can now see how many cores, divisions, and brigades they have. So we have about the same brigades. We have more divisions, but um, definitely, uh, and we only have one core that we're de um, deploying. So, General, the Rebels have deployed two divisions to guard Foxes and Turner's gaps at South Mountain and block your advance against Longstreet. You need to attack, seize these strategic positions, and secure a safe passage for the army. The enemy is outnumbered, but holds strong positions on the high ground. Good luck, General. All right. High ground. Let's see. I guess that is high ground. Huh. All right. Well, it does look like we don't have the uh, quite the range that we did in the map, but that's okay. We can still work it. We can still work it pretty good. I'm going to go ahead and put my more elite men. Marn's men will come over here. Uh, Remus's rovers. I'm going to put the Iron Brigade that way. Sawyer's snipers are going to go here. Um, do I have any other two stars aside from the 1500? I'll go ahead and put the 1500 over here. Now Gaines Gunners and Vinton's Vengeance will go up there. Red Devils, I'm going to push probably over here or to the middle flank. We're going to go ahead and get the fighting first, and Lincoln's Laundryman over there, Boston Standard, and the Blue Horde. We'll go right there. We can push our rookie guys over here, so let's just drop all of them. We do have a ton of troops. I may go ahead. We may kind of have like four areas, per se. Blue and White Devils, the Not-So-Swiss Guard. There we go. All right, let's go ahead and start. For this battle, I don't think the battle is wide enough to support. Oh, we're already getting hit. I don't think it's wide enough to support. Um, what am I trying to think of? Oh, uh, skirmishers. So I'm actually not going to deploy skirmishers. I know that's kind of weird for me, but definitely uh, don't really see a need, to be honest. Let's go ahead and run. Kind of secure some places before they do. No, no, no. Right there. You guys go right there and run. Run, run, please. Oh, uh, those guys have that front, so we'll go ahead and draw these four brigades right there. And then what I'm going to do over here is I'm actually going to pull... I don't know where those guys are, but I do know that I can pull 
those guys to flank. No, I don't want all of them. No, no, no. Nope. Marn's men, Remus's rovers, and then you three are going to go right here. Alright, so we've spotted some troops. Another cool thing is we have a meter bar. That shows exactly how many troops are on both sides. So we actually outnumbered them by a solid 3,000 men. Uh, the only reason why they said 30,000 is their guns consist of a lot of troops. So that's basically what it is. Uh, let's go ahead and move our cannons up. I completely trust that our soldiers will be able to handle them. We're going to go ahead and move those guys there. We're going to move Butcher Block up there as well. You guys go ahead and run. Do we see anyone over here? Go ahead and get moved up just a little bit. Who else we got? We got our general. Getting hit just a little bit. There's some troops. All right. So honestly, I could go right like that surround them really good right there. Who is this? Jackson? You's gonna get sniped. Speaking, what is this? Aha! Skirmishers! Hello, chum! Snipers! Get in the battle. You're gonna start sniping those 2,600 men. Hold the line. Blue and white devils, you are in some really good territory. Really good cover. I want you to hold. Those skirmishers have already routed. Now we're gonna get hit pretty hard, but I think we can, uh, I think we can outgun them basically. And then we'll go ahead and move you guys right there. Skirmishers have surrendered. Wow, that was fast. And then flanky, flanky. No, no, no. Flanky, flanky. Run. Hold up, hold up. Retreat, dude. What the crap are you doing? Please don't get a volley off. Don't get a volley off. Hold. All your men hold. Hold, men. Now start sniping. There we go. Hold. Hold, hold. Hold. Awesome. Turn. Sweet. That is working very well. Let's go ahead and get them shot up. Let's get Sire Antonius in there. Run. Oh, wow. They've already routed. Getting some solid, solid kills in here. Come back, Lincoln's Laundry Men. Fold on them. Oh, there's Ripley. Okay, never mind. We got some unexpected troops coming in. Really starting to route those guys. It's really, really awesome. Let's go ahead and see if they have anyone over here. Ripley has come out. Turn and face them. Go up a little bit. Go ahead and push up, though. Doing some solid, solid flanking at the moment. Go ahead and move on them. Not so Swiss Guard. You're finally getting some kills. You're leveling out. Those guys aren't doing too bad. There they are. I knew they had someone over there. That's a three-star. Those guys are some pretty elite troops. Shoot Anderson if you're going to shoot someone. Lincoln's Laundryman. Uh, you go ahead and go right here, actually. Fire. Whew, taking some hits.
but they are too. Good lord, look at that. Sweet, we're pushing that flank hard. But it's working quite well. Fire! Now here's where we're going to push our luck just a little bit. Uh, you know what? Let's go ahead and have him start firing over there. We're going to try and draw roads out. Hold. Uh, let's go ahead. Okay, they're getting wrecked, aren't they? There's Evans. Hold, hold. Yeah, that's not a good move. That's not a good move. There's Rhodes. Here's what we're gonna do. Let's get freaking flankers. I'm about to sacrifice a lot of men for this maneuver. Let's go ahead and get those guys moved up. The fighting first, you get moved up as well. Don't really know of a good way to try and root those men out. Move those up a little bit. Move back. Let's go this way. We'll see if we can't flank him. Hold up, hold up. Fall back. Reading rainbow, you go a different direction. Fire on the fighting, or on Ripley. Whoa, 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 fall back. 1500, that's exactly what I wanted to happen. The blue horde can move up now. Saw your snipers. Hold, men. Hold. Okay, you're going to get flanked. Yep, I just lost you. You keep going after them, that's fine. You move over this way. 6% of our men are gone. It's an acceptable loss. They're doing extraordinary. Uh, I don't know where Rhodes went. They probably already recovered. Frickin' flankers. Go ahead and drive them off the map. You guys come up here. Uh, reading Rainbow, go ahead and come up. Fire when ready. There we go. Okay, so they're gone. Come up here, come up here. We're gonna start flanking them hard. Uh, we're gonna keep you on the battlefield. Vinton's Vengeance can come up. You guys can come up as well. Run, run. You're gonna get flanked on the side, Evans. We're gonna do a big, huge, wide flank. Saw your snipers go ahead and start coming up. Reading Rainbow come up as well. You guys have lost a lot of men, but you're doing okay. There's Rhodes. We're going to push Evans. We're going to push the Blue Horde up as well. Gains Gunners. Fire and really hit that flank. No, go that way, dude. That's where I want you to attack. No. Listen to me. There you go. That way you don't get a flanking penalty. Big fat idiot. Go! Fall back. Take on Lee. And we're engaged in melee by freaking Sawyer snipers. You are an idiot. Move on them. There you go, boys. Get out of there. Oh no, not detach. No, no, wrong one. Reattach. 
There we go. Hit them from the side. Go ahead and move up, Blue Horde. Union has secured Stone Mountain. Now you guys can charge into them. That's fine. We got an hour. Push Dayton. Actually, hold back. They can't fire at me from there. So they have to move up. No, guys. Don't worry about that dude back there. Ammo. These guys need ammo. Move up on Colquitt. Rhodes, we're taking them on. Red Devils, you go up there. Evans, let's push. Ow, ow. What in the heck is coming from there? We've got it. Oh, I was about to say, Kemper. We've got us. They had something I couldn't see. Let's move up. Sweet. We've routed those guys. Let's start moving up our reserves. Lincoln's Laundryman, hold. I don't know where the heck you think you're going. McRae has routed. Let's go ahead and go after Drayton. Let's go ahead and go after Garnett. Anderson's going to route here pretty soon. The Blue Devils, they're getting wrecked. Or the Blue Horde, excuse me. We're going to have to devote some men to them. Go ahead and move up. Reading Rainbow, you push. Not so Swiss Guard, you push as well. Grant's Praetorians, Macintosh's iMac, you come up. Ripley, you're over there. Perfect! Doing well, man. Let's go ahead and fall back. Blue Horde, you come up. We've lost 12% of our men. How many have they lost? gonna tell me they've lost let's see we've lost four almost five thousand they've lost close to eight it's looking good my friends looking good Drayton's gonna destroy us if we don't move quickly let's go ahead and move them out here I want to make sure that those guys are dead Kemper what you doing freaking flankers fall back man get Boston standard up here Perfect. Hit him in the side. There's Ripley. Let's get my snipers on him as well. Running low on ammo. Lawton, you come up here. The not so Swiss Guard are starting route, but that's okay. Lincoln's Laundrymen, Grant's Praetorians, all of you. Let's go ahead and hit you. Go ahead and hit you. Anderson. Why won't you die? There we go. Garnett's routed. Go ahead and bring Lincoln's Laundrymen up. Wood Stunnies. Keep pursuing them, boys. Rhodes, Major General Gene Thomas. That sucks. The service to our country is greatly appreciated. 250 kills. Only 91 kills. What's up with that? Focus on those guys instead. Man, Drayton, they are wrecking it, man. We're pushing those guys to the brink. They've routed. Maybe we can get them to... I almost said capitulate, which I guess technically is correct. Come on, man. We'll get Anderson to route. We'll get Drayton around as well. Go after Ripley. Go after those guys. Start reinforcing. No, I don't need you. I need you to start going there. Anderson's routed. We're going to push up. Uh, Devils, come up here and see what you got. Frickin' flankers, go ahead and start working your magic. Let's go ahead and push them. And then we'll push on Anderson. Hold on, Reading Rainbow. Don't get too crazy. Let 
Not so Swiss Guard, you've lost a lot of troops, man. Boston Standard, why don't you go ahead and move up? Overlap. Move up, move up. Reading Rainbow, you focus on Kemper. 17% of our men are dead. But, oh, close to half of theirs are dead as well. So that's, it evens out. Walker. Hold on, Wood Stunnies. You've got a lot of troops firing at you at once. Focus on them. Rhodes, Boston Standard. How many men have we lost? Whew. Six or seven thousand, that's rough. They are starting to route though. Kind of a chain route. Taking these guys out of the woods is not going to be easy, nor is it going to be fun. Get Garnett. Actually, yeah, go after Garnett. Overlap here. Reading Rainbow, hold. Not so Swiss Guard. The Butcher Block, hold. Blue Horde. Boston Standard, all of you hold. Lincoln's Laundryman, you hold. You come over here. It's all your snipers going to get back into the mix. Ten minutes left, boys. We will immediately stop. I cannot afford uh, these losses. Rhodes has just demolished me. Ow! Those cannons are killer. But we have killed quite a few men ourselves. I am very proud of these men today. Move forward. Five minutes. And we're done. Nope. Go ahead and get back. Grant's Praetorians fall back. Wood Stunnies fall back. Remus's Rovers, you'll get up here, but you will fall back. Hold. Snipers. Sniper, sniper. We could push them and crush them, but at the moment in the game, since it doesn't matter who we kill, like it has no effect, we're going to go ahead and finish it. Victory at South Mountain! They deployed 27,000 infantry, we killed 13,000 of them, and 1,400 of their guns. We Neither of us deployed CAV, there's 265 in the mission, those are those skirmishers. We deployed 31,000 infantry exactly, we lost 6,821. Several, several units with several over a thousand. Uh, we only lost one. Gene Thomas, he is a major general. That is very unfortunate. We did get a whole bunch of Springfield 1855s, some Colt 1855s, and some six-pounder wireds. Overall, a very, very successful battle. These guys have leveled up. I'm gonna go ahead and get them into melee groups because that's just the best thing to do with them, honestly. Uh, who else? The freaking flankers. I'm going to get your reload and accuracy up as well. Very nice. No one else because we didn't really... So all we have to do is rebuild the first Legio. We have 15,000 men, $140,000. I only have 16. I can't quite get all the way up there. I also have another career point that we can... Look at that. Victory in every single one of them. The only thing that leaves us now is the Battle of Antietam. Um, $450,000 and 17,000 men if we win that. This is, of course, the last... Uh, battle until they update it. And I'm going to reach out to them probably after I get done with uh, Auntie Adam and uh, say, hey, do you guys have an idea? Like, not to be buggy, not to bug you, but just, hey, do we, do we have something? Just to ask them. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed this battle. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Follow me on Twitch, Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. Be on the lookout for the next episode of Ultimate General Civil War. This is Havoc, and I'm out of here. Peace!